Yeah, thanks, Justin. I'm here at the Carmelo K. Anthony Center on the SU campus. We just got word that Fab Mello, Big East Defensive Player of the Year, is on his way out. We heard before that Dion Waiters is on his way out as well. And this kind of brings up how does this affect Syracuse's academic standing because we know we saw with UConn recently that UConn's not going to be in the tournament next year because they didn't meet the academic score requirements. So how is this going to affect Syracuse because what we know is that things like transfers, players not finishing school and not finishing out the semester, if they do declare for the NBA draft like Waiters and Mello, that does affect your score. So I'm here with Cornell Battle. He's been nice enough to join us here. He's the director of, uh, develop of player development for SU Basketball. Cornell, just tell us a little bit about how this score might affect the team, especially with Waiters and Mello declaring for the draft. Well, it will only affect the score if they don't finish on good academic standing for the semester. Um, from everything that I've seen and everything that I've been told, Dion said he's going to complete all his academic requirements for this semester. Um, nobody's really heard anything from Fab outside of the fact that he you know, released his press statement yesterday. And is this something that uh, some of the players and coaches and other people involved in the, in, in the basketball organization are, are actually worried about doing? Because I know it's been in the news a lot lately. Is this something people are worried about, concerned with? Well, I don't really think it's so much worry or concern because I think everybody understands what they have to do in order to meet the numbers and the requirements that are put in place. So when Coach Beheim was on the committee for it, so he understands it better than any of us. So with him, his understanding and his background knowledge of it, I'm sure he's already expressed that to everybody in academics, the team, and so forth and so on. So, Okay, thanks, Cornell, for your time. Reporting here from the Carmelo K. Anthony Center, I'm Matt Johnson. Justin, back to you.